Hey guys. Woo. Woo. Okay. I get comfortable. First, my birthday is August 31st. This video will be going up September 2nd or September 2nd or 3rd. My birthday is August 31st, um, which is in about three hours and some change. And I was like, you know, came on a getaway trip. And I was like, let me use this moment to speak life into somebody. The sun's already down. I'm like, oh, I wanted to record in the morning. I wanted to do my neutral makeup look because I just came back from like exploring or whatever. I did. I wanted to try something new, so that's why you see the black eyeshadow. But before I ramble, let's get into what this video is about. Um, it's not polite to ask a lady her age, but I'm gonna say guys. And after this, I'm going to be the same age for years. So I am 23. No one ever believes me when I say that I am 23. So this video is gonna be 23 things I learned at 23. I don't have anything written down. I'm not even going to be looking at my phone or anything. I don't want to cut this video. I don't. I just want to talk. Okay? I want to talk. I want to talk about the 23 things I learned at 23. Yeah. Mm -mm. Okay. This video is very impromptu. I bring my camera everywhere. Like, I go anytime I like, travel somewhere or just, I just bring it. So... Just for starters, birthdays are, for me at least, birthdays could be overrated, but I just feel like birthdays are really good ways to recap on your life. Even though January 1st is a new year, I feel like your birthday is really your new year. Because um, you weren't on this, in this world from January 1st, unless your birthday is January 1st, but you know. So, it's the time to recap, regroup. Reevaluate so many things, so many people, so blah 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 blah. Now, number one thing I learned, I'm just saying on top of that, my head. The number one thing I learned at this new age of 23 is um, health is wealth. Health is wealth. Your health is so important to you. Number two, don't be so hard on yourself. Like, we tend to be our hardest critics. Don't be so hard on yourself. Three. Hmm. I would say three would be take time to seize the moment. I know a lot of hungry people, we want to get there, do it, do it, do it. Like, but take time to realize your accomplishments and your goals that you already achieved. Because the things you wrote down on paper a year ago, you're doing all the things that you said, if not more. But yet, you're still not satisfied. Take time to just pat yourself on the back. Four. This is going to be harder than I thought. I should have wrote this down. Ugh. Oh, do you guys like my look? Sorry. I'm very random. So four. Um, have fun with life. Don't take things too seriously. Five. People will fail you. And that brings me to six. Don't put nothing past anybody. Don't, don't like, put your trust in somebody. Because men will fail you. But God is the only person you can trust. What was that? Okay. That was six or seven. Damn. Let's just say it was seven now. We're on seven now. Um, seven. Hmm. Hmm. Seven. Um, don't go for anything less than you deserve. Don't just settle. And that goes with anything, a job, a relationship, clothes. Don't just say, oh, let me just buy this just because. Like, get what you want. Eight. Number eight, sorry. People keep texting me. Some people think it's my birthday today. Okay, I'm sorry. Number eight. Sometimes good people do bad things. Um, you can't expect a person to be anything more than just a person. Sorry, I'm like reading something. Sometimes good people do bad things. Oh man, I don't even know what number I'm on anymore. Ah! Okay, the point of this video is just like, let me just ramble. Cause yeah. <laughs> okay, so the point of this video 
It just I know I don't got a bro wearing glass. Don't don't call me. The point of this video is just to um basically say with age you realize a lot. Um I just feel like with age, age doesn't always come with wisdom because I know people that are in their 40s and a person that's like 20 something that is more wise than a person in their 40s. Um, birthdays are another time for me to realize like, okay, um, have I accomplished what I was set to do by this age, by that age? Like this is my last year of being in my 20s. I'm in my early 20s. Go for it. This is my last year being in my 20, early 20s. And next year I'll be in my mid-20s. And it like, kind of shocked me a little bit. But, hey, some people, I remember I was talking to someone, they said that when they started to, you know, when birthdays were coming, when their birthday was coming there, they would start to actually get a little depressed. Like, oh, they're not where they're supposed to be. They feel like they're supposed to be doing more. They actually want the time to slow down. But... Anyone feeling that way, like, you know, cut yourself some slack. Like, you're where you're supposed to be. You're doing everything for where you're supposed to be in your next age. You're more than what you're supposed to be doing. And what's destined to you, for you is for you. So, if and if you're not where, if you feel like you're not where you're supposed to be, just, like, pray about it. Um, but God doesn't like lazy people, so you can't pray about something. You can't say, oh God, let me pass this exam, and then you're just sitting on your bed or partying all night and you're not studying. Like, you have to put in the work so God can manifest your blessings. Um, this video is trash. <laughs> this video is trash! Mm. But, in this new age, I want to be consistent with everything in my life so that considers YouTube and yeah yeah I still need to drop Hawaii vlog part two but I'm gonna post this first just cuz it's like in the moment more Hawaii vlog is gonna be more to edit so hope you guys enjoy this video um you know what I always say subscribe it's probably the probably the only free subscription that you'll receive uh, I have to hurry up and change. Oh, it's like tradition for me to wear like silk pajamas on my birthday and get a henna. But it's time for me to change because I have to go. Um, I have to go. Okay. <laughs> so, nothing more to say. Uh, happy birthday to me. I don't really get excited for my birthdays. So, I try to fake excited so I can actually get excited. Because they say fake it till you make it. Anyways, hi everything me. And I wish you guys all the best for the last quarter of the year. We have September, October, November, December. Um, four more months left. Make it make it worthwhile. Alright, um this 23 things I learned at 23 actually just turned to a motivational speech. I don't know how, but it it did. And I hope I I help someone that's in a stage where they feel stuck, they're going through a life crisis, they feel like, oh, I'm supposed to be married by this age, I'm supposed to have kids by this age, I'm supposed to have a good job by this age. Listen, just be happy. Simple. Just be happy. Don't stress yourself. It's going to happen. That job you want to get, you're going to get it, if not better. That business you want to start, you're going to start it. That blah, 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 you're going to blah, 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 blah. Okay, bye. <laughs> Subscribe. See you guys in next week. I'm gonna post a Hawaii vlog. Keep my word. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Okay, bye.